सो हेलो स्टूडेंट्स सो टुडे वी विल स्टार्ट थिंग समथिंग न्यू राइट सो फॉर द बिगनर्स फॉर द बिगनर्स दे गो थ्रू द वीडियोज ऑफ वेरी लॉन्ग दे गो थ्रू द वीडियोज ऑफ वेरी लॉन्ग बट समटाइम्स दे आर नॉट एबल टू डाउनलोड द मॉडल सिम कोस्टा सिम और दाइलिंग सिम वर्ड राइट बिकॉज दे डोंट हैव द लिंक और दे डोंट नो दे डोंट हैव द लाइसेंस समथिंग लाइक डेट समटाइम्स दे फील सो for those freshers what they can do there is one good option who don't have any laptop also they can run in the i guess in, in the phone also or the tablet also right or the memory space is not uh, more the, like you can't able to download the software have it down have it have a software then you can just use this eda playground right eda playground this google the eda playground on your browser on any browser uh, go to go to this link eda playground edit codes so here you will get this interface right so uh, we will explore some of the things in this interface here you can write write it down your design part design part you can write write it down here here you can write it down your test bench part and this is your uh, log part right so here we have Imp uh, implementation of different languages like uh, Verilog, System Verilog, VSDL, uh, and some other languages C and all those are also there. But for the C and all, some uh, other uh, other website are more useful as compared to this. As well as for the UVM, this is not uh, this is fine for the Verilog. And sometimes it shows some errors in the Verilog also, or sometimes is it is not showing the right result. But if you are the beginner and you, if you don't have the proper tool then this is one good option you can start at least from the here right obviously proper software are much useful and they give the synthesis part more properly and even simulation part properly but this is also one thing which you can at least start the things right? here we have uh, we can select the simulator also there are so, so many pre simulators and the commercial simulators also uh, after that uh, we have the examples also right we have the already example of design and test benches right so let's say i am going to the vsdl so i am selecting the or gate basic code right uh, code is automatically coming in this so this is the design part this is the design part logic part is this is the logic for the or gate and this is the test bench part this is the test bench part right so they have given the different inputs here you can run your uh, copy if you want to copy and paste it to someone somewhere or you can directly share share to your friends using this link uh, this url will be uh, posted to your friend right uh, uh, now we want to run this but here you they will ask the like login uh, login here the students some student facing the problem sometimes they need a uh college id or co like office id so for those student we have a proper we uh, like how, how to register on the eda playground play right how to eda uh, it is fine code is coming now how to run it program with a registration right uh, so how to do a registration we will uh, discuss in the in in this video by by some of our faculty so you can here you can uh, select the simulator also here you have to select the uh, free simulator right yeah. you can use any simulator uh, yeah, which is supporting you uh, yeah it has a synthesis part also and free simulator simulators are also there so we will uh, show you how to how to register for the ed playground right okay then hello all today we will learn how to register the online verilog simulator that is eda playground mm. We actually we don't know we don't need to download any separate software for simulation Verilog. So we will use the online Verilog simulator that is EDA Playground. So for this, first of all, we have to open our browser and type EDA Playground. Press enter, and we will get this window. On this, we we will click on the EDA Playground edit code option. Now we get this window. This is the brow 
browser window of PDA Playground online learning simulator. Now here we we can design our code here, and this is a test bench code. We can write our test bench code here, and there are three options that is language and libraries. We can choose the language like Verilog, System Verilog, and BSDL like this, and tools and simulator from here. There are many. Options like Comsel Simulator, Synthesis, Free Simulator. So we will use Free Simulator. And after that, first of all, before writing code and test, design code and testing code, we have to log in in this. We can register in EDA program or log in from the from here. So we will click on this option, log in. Now we have two options. Either we can log in from Google or Facebook, or if we have any access from our college or institute, then we can access. Then we can get full access of EDA Playground by username and password. But we are using free. So uh, for free users, we have only two options. That is Google and Facebook. So we now I will click on the Google and I will log in through Gmail account. Now it will ask to sign in through any Google account. Now I am using my Google account. Now it will ask the password. Type your password. Click on next. Now we have we will successfully log in into the EDE playground. Now we can check from here. This our profile is successfully created, and after doing our work, we can log out also. So I will use for the, for doing simulation my one code that is full header code using arc header. So, This is a design code which will write. I will write here, and this is my test bench code. Now, for before doing this, I will select before running, saving. It will ask a valid tool or simulators. Okay. So we will use only free simulator. I will use this, and all these options are same. But we we also want the simulation from after running. So we will. Click on this option. Open the app to run. Right now, I will save it. It will. It is saved, and now I will run it. Now it is running. Okay. Run again. Okay, it, we will add our signal to this. So we can use get signal TB and let's call it and append all close it. Okay, now we can change from X to binary like this. So we get the simulation waveform of full header. Now we can recheck if we have the three inputs and uh, some is carry as output. So we get uh, for one. On with this, I get some one and carry zero, right? We can you can check here also. Okay, moving one step forward like this, we get this simulation by form of full header. Now, like this, 
guys listen if you find any problem in login then you can do one thing just type control h you have to clear your browsing history right you can clear your browser history and all time clear and login again then you i believe that you will successfully login thank you all for joining us okay then thank you guys so just watch it once and uh, just give your feedback in the comment section so we can work accordingly and what the next video you want we can uh, tell you about the model sim vivado all these things also if you want fine thank you